All right, here we are back again with Last Blitz Creek. It's the 17th of December, beginning of the turn, and the ally and the Allies do not have the, the Americans, the US forces, whatever the hell you want to call them, they do not have initiative. So they're going to be going second uh, no matter what, unless the Germans elect to pass. They would be dumb to do so because there are uh, two uh, big or four big stacks actually of uh, reinforcements there waiting to come on board and then there's also a stack of reinforcements here. That's the uh, 7th Armored Division, 9th Infantry and 1st Infantry Division uh, all bringing on uh, uh, reinforcements this turn. Now, uh, so let's look at the German side of the equation. Well, actually, let's look at the uh, the Americans first because they're kind of in the, the worst situation that may take the longest to assess. Up in the northern part of the northern map, we have the 2nd Infantry Division. Uh, I, do, I managed to activate them last turn, and I did not apply uh, replacements for these guys, so I might actually pop a replacement on here. No, you know what? I'll just do that later. Otherwise, I'll forget. So uh, we need to uh, kind of keep this road blocked here. So having two units there will uh, slow down the 12th SS, which did not get to activate in the very first turn. So it could come this way or it could come down this way. So I need to keep that blocked for the time being. I need to reinforce this little section here just in case these relatively weak uh, 326 Vol um, Volks Grenadiers do continue to push down this way. So I need to block those two roads. Uh, the rest of my forces are kind of scattered around here and moved in desperation mode to um, Buchenbach to hold this uh, key location there that would uh, block me from reinforcing this way. I uh, would keep all those units pocketed up in there. So I need to strengthen this area here. Depending on what the Germans do first, this could be a real problem at the very beginning of the 17th with only two battalions and an engineering formation uh, sitting there in um, Wollongen, which is a VP hex as well. So that could be a pretty dicey situation for the, for the Allies. They're going to need to reinforce that quickly. So I would probably, I think, first thing I'm going to do is try and uh, activate when I have my opportunities, activate uh, second infantry and try and shuffle some more guys down this way and push this dude down here somewhere We'll see if we can't do that uh, Alternatively as an, as an as an alternative uh, I may I may be able to bring on the 9th infantry or the 7th armored and 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 hot foot it up into this zone probably looking to establish a line somewhere around uh, Wames here Vames here. Yeah, this this road uh, road line would be good. This area here would be a good place to try and defend. Uh, I guess alternatively we could activate nine C, uh, the the ninth armored formation here, push them further up this way as a stopgap me measure or up into here. Uh, but they have to deal with Piper, who uh, is well positioned to either go north or continue uh, southwest. So difficult situation. 106th is pretty much screwed. They're they're dead guys. They're all gonna die. So I'm not sure what we'll end up doing with them. We may just uh, let them wither on the vine there and and try and uh, extract what we can out of this mess and and pop them over the Ore River and and work on our uh, defense there. Those guys will all still be in prepared defenses. So that is good. That is good news. But we have nothing between uh, Piper and uh, St. Vith, uh, Vith at this point. It's a, a thinly held line. So this is another area that needs to be reinforced, but I think we can get uh, seventh, uh, seventh Division over here, uh, Seventh Armored over to this area and let the fight for St. Vith play out as that, uh, as that, in that case may be. So pretty, pretty difficult situation for the Allies. Now, of course, all the uh, fun and games is really for the Germans, and uh, they have a lot of choices to make. They can uh, uh, activate, first off, maybe 150th uh, Panzer, uh, this Panzer group here, and push them through this direction. That's pretty easy for them to get around here and uh, either knock these guys out and capture that VP hex, uh, or, can, or press up this way and try and isolate these guys. That would then clear the way for us to 
either potentially reverse back out here and bring uh, Piper this way or that way. So they're probably gonna be the first guys we try and activate. Or maybe we try and, we try and get uh, 12th SS and 1st SS onto the map uh, so that we can do something with them. But I think uh, the smart money might be to clear this, this little cluster here, clear things up and start getting some uh, units moving in, some definitive formation groups as the case may be. All right, uh, so that's that. Uh, I'm not using the roll barn rules per se. There are these, you know, lanes where the different army groups had to uh, stay, keep enforced. I'll, I'll look at it to make sure I'm not doing, doing anything too stupid, but we're, we're not paying too much attention to these dotted lines. Uh, 3FJ, I want to keep uh, pushing down this way to uh, sync up with 18th uh, Volksgrenadier and keep this isolation activity going on. Uh, and then maybe allow some of uh, 62nd uh, VG to press up to this bridge and threaten the southern flank of uh, St. Vith. So lots of activities to, to choose from. I think in the very first instance, instance it's going to be 150th and then Piper and then 12th or, or 12th and Piper, depending on, uh, on the occasion. Uh, 277th, we'll, we'll try and uh, push in this way and, and press on this big stack of stuff here, which is mainly units that have taken step losses, uh, which will probably get, uh, uh, get some recovery going uh, once we put the replacements out, uh, which I have not done yet. All right, so that's a, a quick look at uh, both sides, uh, strategic or tactical options as the case may be, and I will uh, get cracking on it. We'll talk to you guys in just a while. Later.